so how have you been i hope you're all doing well yes this is me trying to do my uh podcast at the same time as record a video yes <laughs> i'm just trying to have like the two platforms grow in the two platforms because i've come to realize uh in one nina delay then in the other one mm. so i want the two of them growth pamoja so how have you been so this is just like a catch-up video and testing things out and seeing if everything is okay so welcome to another episode of conversations with Lea, both on the podcast and also as a video so let me know in the comment section how you've been doing yes how have you been doing by the way i hope you've all been doing well <laughs> As for me, nimekuwa, yes, motherhood, motherhood, learning every day, making mistakes, ah, making mistakes and learning from them, that's something that sucks, <laughs> but it's the reality, you know, it's the reality, so just tell me how you have been, let's just catch up, catch up kwa comment, kwa comment section, let's just catch up, as for me, nimekuwa tu, nimekuwa poor by the way, I cannot complain, I'm healthy. You know nowadays if you're healthy, thank God. If you have food, thank God. I am grateful. Tumesiaga unga. How many of us? Because man, this 100 bob unga, how many of us have seen it because I've not? Every time we go to the supermarket, hakuna. So, me what I opted to do like long 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 time ago. Me nilisiaga mahindi. Yes, I went to the posho meal with my maize and now I have very healthy ugali. Yeah, I'm being healthy. <laughs> Yes, you know, it's it's a good thing. So, if you have access to me, is able just see that unga and just roll with it. So, how have you been? Elections ni next week, by the way. Today is the Thursday. If I'm not, uh, today is Thursday. If I'm not wrong, is it the 4th or uh, something like that? Yes. And next week ni elections. So, able tell me, hey, this election, me, I'm praying God for peace. Let's always remember peace because these politicians, at the end of it, they are trying to do this for themselves, not for us. Mm -mm. I, okay, I know we say vote and then for good leaders. If we want to change things, we need to vote. It's true. Let's vote. When at times we wonder who to vote for, <laughs> who is the lesser evil, I know. That is what I always wonder and think. So if you have an opportunity to go vote, Ebu and a vote. Sawa, end up pika hizo queue, vote for the leader that you want. But at the end of it all, leader wako has pochaguliwa, my friend. Usijali, ni life. Sini life. That is life. Life, life, life. Yes, so at the end of it, as pochaguliwa, usijali, just appreciate and move on. We need to move on because there's no time for sijui what. For this do we watch shenanigans that you now we are getting angry and we are fighting for who? You're fighting for who? Do you think he is putting food in your table? For example, right now if you have a problem, see neighbor kusaidia, who will help you if not your neighbor? Your immediate neighbor actually. So come on kikuyu mjaluo mturkana muwapi. Why should you fight them? Because somebody said we should fight. I, my friend, even though they incite you, able just don't. Because your neighbor, for example, if you got sick at night, who will help you? See, it's your neighbor. So just appreciate your neighbor. Even at a jina, you know, at times, especially those of us living in Nairobi, you do not even know who your neighbor is. <laughs> I know, yeah. At times you say hi to one another, at times you don't even give a foot. But it's fine. Just love one another. Let's love our neighbors. Let's just let's just live in peace. Peace, 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 peace is what I'm requesting, is what I'm praying for. At the end of this, eh? You know, let me tell you, you remember like the Nusumkate happened. You know, first of all, these people who want these seats, they were once on the same side. <laughs> Only that right now, they are opposites. They are opposing one another. They are opposers, you know. But they were once, who, who, nani ya mekwambia, like after this election, they won't be on the same side. Maybe there'll be another handshake. Like now the opposition and the, the leading whatever. Maybe there'll be another handshake next year, you know. So why should we fight? Why should we like listen to them and please just vote. If you want to vote, vote. If you have Kura, if you have your ID and you are registered, vote. Yes. And then after that, chill now, relax. Even nakama you don't want to go and vote, then you have an off day. If Hamwendi job you see, kumaze la la, relax kwa nyumba. La la, kama kuna mangozi nafa kufuli wafua. You know, 
ka hauna anything ya kufanya mazee ingia to bed lala you know instead of causing chaos out there just go and sleep just go and sleep sleep just sleep usiku hata na maneno mob wewe enda ula enda ulale and then you wake up the following day you go to work more energized but kama uko na kura na unaona it's everybody's right to vote so just go and vote yes that's all i can say yeah that is one of the things that is happening that is what we are expecting that is uh that one in elections yes so when it comes to elections let's just be peaceful 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 and remember that in this country it's everybody for himself and god for us all okay don't forget that so don't 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 hate somebody for their tribe don't hate somebody because you they're supporting who and you are supporting who even though you're supporting wajakoya and me i'm supporting maore it's fine it's fine sawa so let's peace 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 that's all i can say on that topic okay yes so my second topic would be <laughs> Leo na chapatu story by the way because hey god has helped and my baby is over there sleeping so i take advantage of her when she's sleeping so that i can create something for myself the second point would be how many of us like mothers or parents and man and trying to get a job after giving birth you know what happened <laughs> in my job the job that i had let me just say i had i think i still have it because i thought whenever i want to go back i can go back <laughs> but they don't give maternity leave yes so when it comes time to go deliver go deliver but unapewa inaitangwa leave of absence yes you're not paid you don't get paid ah uh-uh, ah paid for who for who are we the ones who told you to go give birth huh? ah <laughs> yeah are we are we the ones who told you to go and give birth <laughs> anyway but still life yeah so i was just told you yes go take your time whenever you want to come back but it was it, it's a, it's a sales job so yeah a sales agent i was a sales agent for one of these companies i was a tailor sales agent let me just say was because at the moment i, I don't know if my city still there because i've seen they got new people and stuff like that but in life so i was just wondering where you work are you given maternity leave because by the way if they had given me maternity leave i would have probably just gone back like kitambo but then now there was no maternity leave so i was like oh my god so how do <sighs> anyway see this life <laughs> at the moment i don't have any source of income and it sucks man it sucks you know like when you were used to some money getting into your account at the end of every and that's why we are told by the at is employment mm. employment but i'm saying it could be like you're self employed or you are employed and then there's some money coming into your account and then now there's no money coming into your account what is happening is you getting money out of the account all the time and then now one day you try to remove to get some money from the account and then your account tells you oops sorry and then you try to check your balance and you're like my goodness what happened to my money <laughs> you forget that you were just taking and you are not putting money back so right now i am looking for an opportunity to leave put money back into my account because there's nothing as peaceful as having your own source of income it feels good it does not matter if you have a spouse who is supportive <laughs> what i say is when you have tested your own money ah uh-uh, ah it yani pesa yako inaonja tu tofauti it's just sweet in a sweet way you know what i'm saying i don't know how many of you can come with that but as for me i miss having a source of income and i am praying to god god as you bless people with sources of income please don't forget me please remember me yes i want to watch this video a while uh, some days to come and then i'm like yes god answered me so please if you've not subscribed please subscribe nifike a thousand subscribers at least nimesha fikisha the 400 hours so now what i'm praying for is for a thousand subscribers angalau so that i can start probably you know when by the way when you get to a thousand i believe you endelea 
but I am so grateful for everybody who have subscribed and even for the podcast, everybody who has listened or downloaded the episode. I am grateful. You know, it is conversations with Leia, with Sony. <laughs> you know, I am so, so, so grateful. Yeah, there's a kind of episode I put and it got so many views on podcast. And man, was I not happy? I, I was happy. I was celebrating. I know something that in a nilemeanga, ni consistency. But now I am very determined and very, I am, yani, takuwa hmm. nanalisha mtoto hivo, wana venye, si usema ati, when you're a mom, like when your baby just sleeps, you also want to, cause especially when they're young, when they just sleep, you also want to sleep because of marathon when they wake up. But now I want to try and squeeze some time and just be consistent in this content creation because I know I have something. And I know that it can get me something. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And if you're watching and probably you have always wanted to have something and you wonder how to start, imagine just start. Like now I'm shooting with my phone. Okay, yes. I know I bought this mic. It was even less than 500 bob. Okay, this one I bought Kitambo, but anyway. Just start with your phone. Just start with anything. That's all I can say. Okay, yes. So, ni a story. Naona, it's 11 minutes. Is it long? Uh, is it long enough? No, I don't think it's long enough. But with time, look, so I'm, I'm preparing topics that I'll be speaking about. I would really love to, like post something every day, God willing, or at least five days a week. Can I commit to that? I should commit to that, right? Yeah, and just try and see. You know, it's good to try than to not have tried. And then you're like, oh my God, things didn't go. But you didn't try. Hmm? And then don't let anybody put you down because they think their career is superior than yours and you don't have a career. My friend, huh? God who blessed them with that career can also bless you. Tuko pamoja? So, don't let anybody put you down, Abby. Do not let anybody put you down. For what? Are they God? Charlie. Do they, do, God does not go to them to request to come and bless you. So head high. Sour. Even those of us who do not have jobs, God is going to remember us someday, very soon. Yes, we shall get a income. You know, whatever your desire is, even maybe you're, you're, you're in a job because how na otherwise we are in a job, unaona, like, man, I have to pay bills, so I have to work. So whatever comes, I've been there, I know. Like, whatever comes, atakama tunambua tu uze, sijui nini, we unauza tu. You just do any job because you're like, at the end of it, I am going to get a salary and my bills are going to be paid. I pray that you may continue working. Honestly, just work, religious, yani work, work. And I know one day, one day, God will give you what you deserve. Okay? Because at times, we are working for peanuts, man. <laughs> like you have experience for 10 years, no, like 5 years in a field, but badu unataka kulipa 25k. But, sababu that, iyo ndo imepatikana utafanya, you take it, you know. So don't worry, God will shine his face. He always does. He hachelewi. Na hakuharakishi. There's a verse that says that. He comes at the right time. So at the right time, let's just wait for him. Let's wait for God. Let's wait for God, by the way. Me, I'm waiting for him. Eh, hey, the way I'm waiting for him to do miracles for me. There are miracles I'm just waiting. I'm like, God, but you've written it in your word. You have written it in your word. It is written. So I am just reminding him. And when those things happen, I will remember to be grateful, by the way. I will, I will, I will. I remember to thank him because that's the most important thing. Remember the, 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 were the lepers who were healed, the people who were healed, and only one came back to say thank you. And God was pleased with that one person. So let's always remember to be grateful. It is very, 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 very important. Okay. Let me just finish the episode here and then so that I can shoot another one for posting tomorrow now that I have time. Let me finish this episode here and then we shall talk tomorrow, okay? Thank you so much for listening. Thank you so much for watching. I am so grateful and I hope to see you next time. Same place. Na kama una watch, na huja subscribe. Unangoja, please subscribe. And also, 
I love you so much and I pray that God will answer you. He will answer your heart desires, even the deepest of your prayers. May he remember you. Okay, so thank you so much. And until next time, peace.